it's a film that because of the personal aspect of it, it does somehow speak to people. Mm -hmm. A lot of people see it and are moved by it, and I think it's because of the personal voice um, in it. It's not a documentary that's, you know, that's lecturing to you, that's didactically kind of telling you what to think. So I think, you know, it fits in kind of within my work as a whole in terms of blending personal and ethnographic voices. Mm -hmm. You know, it's there as kind of part part of the, uh, an example of the way I do anthropology. So I think it's, it's going to continue to have that role. Um, and it's a document of a particular moment in the history of the Jewish Cuban community. Right. Um, and so it will certainly be a chronicle right. of a particular moment. And obviously things in Cuba will evolve and they will evolve here as well. And in five or 10 years, the community might be extremely different. You know, the regime changes or whatever happens. Um, so it will certainly be a historical chronicle uh, of a certain moment when I happen to be there filming and gathering the story. Sure. Um, so it'll serve that purpose as any ethnography does. It's a chronicle mm -hmm. of a historical moments. 